on. Um, thought I'd bring you the good old uh, carpet wall floor angle here. One of my favorite angles. Um, I had a few requests for the Adrian Gonzalez PC, so I will show it. Um, it's not not like particularly uh, you know spectacular or nothing, but um, it's a work in progress. It's always building. Uh, just like a disclaimer beforehand, I got a moment of milestones plate incoming. Another triple threads auto, triple game use incoming, and um, an auto from 05 Trilogy incoming, uh, number to five, so, uh, yeah, so, here's uh, the first Adrian card I ever bought, uh, his rookie card, my only Adrian rookie card, like, uh, like, I'm, I, like, I consider myself a super collector and probably one of the top Adrian collectors out there, but I'm not, like, up there with, like, the super Adrian collectors, because, uh, this is, I don't have many rookies, so, uh, this is my only one, BCCG, um, 2000 Bowman draft picks, uh, so that's nice, um, then, uh, all my inserts and numbered are mostly in a binder with all my base cards and stuff, too, so, um, here's, here's just some of the numbers I have top-loaded, uh, Red Refractor, uh, from this year's finest, number to 25, um, this base card from 07, uh, what am I thinking of, Upper Deck Premier, number 205, I don't know if you can see that, fine, number 5, um, this one from, uh, 08, Top's Finest, Finest Moments, and, uh, I got the, uh, the blue and the gold incoming, and I just need the green and the regular refractor, and then I'll have, uh, this rainbow done, waiting for the, you know, the framed white X-Fractor to come on the market. Um, so there's that, and then, uh, pretty, I guess that's pretty much it, the, uh, the Bowman Chrome Rainbow going here, let me lay this out for you, give you a nice little overhead shot of it, um, I picked up the Red Refractor one day, and I was like, fuck it, I'll just do the whole set, uh, so there, you can see that whole thing, uh, we got the, uh, the Red Refractor, Gold Refractor, Orange Refractor, base card, blue refractor, x-fractor, chrome, and, uh, other chrome base cards, so, there's that stuff, um, the game used, something weird about Adrian Gonzalez's cards, he does not have that many just game used cards, um, he's got a number of them from when he's, like, 2000 to 2001, uh, but I, I, you know, I don't really buy those, I usually go for kind of the high-end stuff, so, um, these are, these are his first patch cards out there. I only have three game use cards, and uh, they're his first patch cards that are just plain patches, not patch auto, just plain patches. So um, here they are from the Retro Spectrum. You guys know I'm trying to put that set together. Um, and uh, there's that one, which is a good looking one. Hopefully I'm not boring you guys too bad. Uh, I got the TTM autos coming up, don't worry. And uh, some better stuff coming up here. Um, here's, this one is the first one I ever got from him, this is the first TTM I ever sent out, um, I got it like four or five months later, so, you know, what are you gonna do, uh, you know, good enough to sign it for me, what the fuck, is tripping this stuff in here, alright, anyways, uh, yeah, so I got that one, and, uh, this one is my most recent one, sent it to him in spring training, got it back about two weeks later, I have another one, but it's on a turkey red card in the... It's framed with all my other Padres TTMs, so, uh, yeah, there's that. Then, uh, let's move along to the autos, I guess. Um, what am I gonna start with here? The by the letters. Uh, here you go. Um, this one, actually, I got all these here. Uh, I got a few of them, and normally, you know, I really like to put sets together and stuff. Hold on, let me cut a second. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, so he's messing around here behind me. Um, but anyways, like I was saying, I got these. And normally, I would put the set together, um, because I, I like putting the sets together and stuff. But, uh, if you will see this, um, people out there, you give me your decision. Is this an O or a D? And that is why I won't do it, because, like, I would always have it in my mind, is it an O or a fucking D? And I hate that because all the Padres in the set do, so I still have that in my mind about my Kevin Kuzma off D and my Padres set. So I know this one looks like an O, but I've heard O, I've heard D, you know, whatever. And then I got the R and the Z. And so I can't really do either part of his name without, uh, you know, wondering if it's an O or a D, which, uh, which I hate. I cannot stand that. 
All right, let's go to some of the more common ones here. Um, Upper Deck Spectrum 07, number to 99 auto. Um, 07 Sweet Spot glove, uh, number to 25. I was going to try and do like all the parallels of this. I still will. I'll still try and do it. I've uh, just been slacking off on that one. Um, 05, I believe, Upper Deck Etchings, number to 1325 auto. Uh, this one is not numbered. Uh, from 05 Donruss Team Heroes uh, Auto. This is, I believe, 2005 Leaf Certified Cuts, number 2100. This is 07 Masterpieces, Strokes of Genius, not numbered. Um, Allen and Ginter uh, Auto here. I just missed out on the red auto like two days ago. Some person, I'll uh, refrain from obscenities, but some person sniped me with five seconds left. I, my bid was like 58 and he went up to 60 or something so he got that I was so pissed about that oh my god I was like torn up about that for all, all day um, number 200 right here Don Russ classics 2005 significant signatures and then uh, this one I guess I think it's my most recent one uh, the uh, 07 uh, Bowman's best Adrian Gonzalez so uh, thanks Joe for that one um, let's see what's next here. I guess I will do these. Uh, some of them somewhat higher end. This is one of my favorite cards right here. Uh, Upper Deck Black. Um, there's pretty sick patches down there if you can see them. It looks like a part of the P from Padres or something. And uh, number to 75, so I'm probably going to get another one or two of these. Because uh, there's one for pretty low buy now, right now. Um, uh, there's this one right here. Um, Upper Deck Black. I really liked Upper Deck Black. I like, I like, I like the product. Um, obviously the price tag was ridiculous, but I thought it was a real good looking product, so um, I picked up some of this. Uh, there's this one. These are both from Upper Deck Black. Um, then uh, Tops Triple Threads. The Golden Parallel, which is uh, numbered... Oh, it's number 25. I just got the Green Parallel yesterday, which I, I was advertised as being numbered to 25. I'm not sure what's up with that. And then the, the Red Parallel here, numbered to 99. Oh shit, my battery's dying. Alright, I'm gonna hurry up. It could cut out at any time though. Uh, oh shit, don't. I gotta save that one for last. It's my best one. Alright, sorry about that. Alright, sorry about that, guys. Um, here we go again. Um, here's the one of ones. Uh, let's start out with the weakest one right here, which is the Moments of Milestones. Uh, you know, some people don't consider these one of ones, but, you know, it's serial numbered, so whatever. I will uh, accept it into the one of one family. Um, so there's that. Then, uh, let's do this one. Another Upper Deck Black card here, 101. I picked it, again, I picked this thing up for $30, the 101 auto from this. You know, it was $100 a pack, and a 30 bucks for a 101, so, you know. That just shows you how much people really hated this fucking product, so. I love it. Send it to me if you got any. Um, here is this one. This is another one of my favorites, the Topps Allen and Ginter. Um, this is, I believe, the Cyan, 101. Uh, printing plate here, so I was trying to get all the parallels, you know, I told you about the Red Refractor just a second ago or not Red Refractor, Red Ink Auto number to 10, so I wanted to get that obviously I didn't get that, uh, I want to get the wood and, you know, all the one one parallels for this card so, hopefully I'll get that um, then you guys have seen this one my favorite card uh, 2003 Albuquerque Isotopes Multi-Ad 2003 uh, AAA Baseball Adrian Gonzalez Albuquerque Isotopes card so that's cool. And then, some of you have seen it, some of you have not. Uh, this, is, this is my second favorite card, my my best card, my collection. Um, this, you know, everybody talks about, like, wanting to get, like, a defining um, card for, like, their PC. Like, you know, like, what's the best p card possible? And, la like, a few weeks ago, I missed out on one of them, which would be Upper Deck Premier Bat Barrels, number to three, Adrian Gonzalez. I missed out on that. Went up to 250 bucks. I did not have the cash. Then just about two days ago, I missed out on a, they had a, uh, what am I thinking of, Rede redemption um, set for the whole last name from Upper Deck SP Authentic number to 205. So I missed out on that because somebody outbid me in the last second up to $200. So, you know, again, I'll refrain from, uh, you know, obscenities, but um, insert your own, uh, you know, insert your own profane word there, insulting him. Because he deserved it for sniping me like that. What a punk. Anyways, here is my defining card right here. The uh, 
Adrian Gonzalez, um, button, uh, logo man, patch, auto, uh, 